The Galactic Empire first appeared as the main antagonist of the first Star Wars movie, Star Wars, Episode IV A New Hope, in 1977. It later appeared in the two other films of the original trilogy, Star Wars, Episode V The Empire Strikes Back and Star Wars, Episode VI Return of the Jedi. George Lucas later used the prequel trilogy to chronicle the events which led to the rise of the Empire. The Empire's origins and role in the Star Wars universe were subsequently expanded by various expanded universe literature and media over the next four decades. Following the Lucasfilm Story Group's decision in May 2014 to reboot the Star Wars universe, the Galactic Empire reappeared as a major antagonist in new canonical media and literature, including the Disney XD television series Star Wars Rebels. According to the author Jason Fry, the Galactic Empire in the newly established canonical universe was not openly xenophobic and misogynistic, unlike the Legends version. However, he acknowledged that some of the Empire's most devoted supporters were xenophobes, like his character Jaina Sarek, a minor antagonist in his 2014 junior novel Servants of the Empire, Edge of the Galaxy. In his view, the presence of prominent Imperial female characters in John Jackson Miller's novel A New Dawn and Star Wars Rebels precluded the idea of a misogynistic empire. Pro-human xenophobia within the Imperial military and government bureaucracy has since been confirmed in the reference guides Star Wars Rebels, The Visual Guide and Star Wars Rebels, Visual Guide, Epic Battles, and the novels Aftermath, Life Debt and, particularly, Thrawn. Financial engineering professor Zachary Feinstein calculated that the hypothetical GDP of the Galactic Empire would be 4.6 sextillion per year.